now we're going to add square roots uh, where what the, the radicand, the part that's under the radical, are x's. Well, we learned how to simplify square roots with powers earlier. If you remember, when we have a square root, we want the power to be even because the square root is the same as the half power. And when we multiply by a half, that's the same as dividing by 2. So x cubed, we want to write as x squared times x. This cannot be simplified. Now this, I'll do this step by step. So this is the square root of x squared times the square root of x. Now, what is the square root of x squared? Well, the square root of x squared is the same as x squared to the half power so we divide when we multiply the exponents here. It's our rule of exponents. But multiplying by a half is the same as dividing by 2. So we divide the exponent by 2. We get 5x times x is x squared. Well, I'll do it step by step. So this is x. The square root of x squared is x. Bring your radical down. Here we have 2x squared root x. All right. This is the same as 5x squared, square root of x, plus 2x squared, square root of x. Well, to add these, well, these are, keep it, I notice there's an x squared, square root of x in both of these. So 5, you could think of this as factoring out an x squared root x. And when you factor that out from both terms, you're literally taking it out and we're left with 5 plus 2 which is 7 so we end up with 7 x squared times the square root of x so this is a simplified form of that